I'm saying? You already know what it is, man. Bike with another one, man. You know. Um, man. I be going through hell, man. I know y'all do too, trying to help wake people up, man. Because sometimes they just get to you. But you got to keep fighting, man. Got to keep fighting. Make sure y'all hit that subscribe button, man. If you subscribe to the channel already. Also, check out the merch, man. That's how we put everything out, though. That's how we pay for promotions and stuff like that. We take our proceeds, and this is how we spread the message. Because they don't want people to know this stuff. Right? Let me tell y'all something real important, right? Check this out. Let me tell you something. Bro. You are a reflection to everything around you. Understand that. What you put out comes back. This is no, I don't know what people might feel and think. This is no uh, fairy tale shit. It's common sense, really, if you think about it. One small hack you could do is this. And it's going to sound crazy to song, but hear me out. Trust me when I tell you. One small hack that you could do change your environment meaning change your room around if you got clutter move that shit out the way give it away don't just have it sitting in your house and somebody could be using it change your environment and watch how you change watch how your attitude change watch how you your mood change this is exactly this is exactly what i mean by when you move in a certain way the universe will open up and assist you it's the same as when you go wash your car. When you wash your car, your shit just seem to ride better. You feel what I'm saying? If you got your garage all tore up, man, clean that motherfucker out. Clean up around your space. Meaning people in your life, clean them up. It's the same thing. It's nothing different, bro. When you do that, you will see things change. Change, brain change. You can throw a small pebble of sand in the sea. It just changed it. You have to understand that. No matter how big, small, changes change. But when you clean up around your area, like, go, go clean up, go clean up your house. I'm talking about, or your room, bathroom, closet. Get rid of that stuff you ain't just laying around, man. Just, man, that shit, you a reflection of your environment. You a reflection of the universe, of, what, of what's around you, your circumference. You have to take heed to that because you are responsible for that. You feel me? And when you, it's like when you look, when you look nice or you moving, how you feel? You know what I mean? Another hack. If a big gave you a million dollars, oh, you happy. You know what I'm saying? A big gave you a car. Ooh, I'm happy. You got that car. Bro, you can hack yourself to be happy without that car or that money. I'm going to say it again. You can hack yourself to be happy just as well as you will be for big a your million dollars or a car you don't need things to change your mood you can change your mood you got to hack yourself i told you the the, the biggest thing to conquer is yourself and i'm to, i'm showing y'all things bro that i had to it took me a while myself to really see but once you become one within one of yourself everything move out the way for you Trust me when I tell you. You can hack yourself to be happy without that million dollars, without that car. You feel me? The same feeling you get. So just say, just say to yourself, if you had a million dollars, how, did, how would you feel? Bro, you can have that feeling every day, and that's free. You can hack yourself to have that same, that same joy, that same happiness for free. But we in this world where we feel as though we need this to validate our happiness. No, the fuck we don't. These are so many ways of how the government attack us. Because I tell y'all, everything that they do alongside of them is a, is a, 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 a psychologist, psychologist. Psychologist. Psychologically, they find the, the, uh, the psychology in anything they're doing and how to implement that on us as people. Psychology is in everything they do. That's why I tell y'all they attack you by colors. You think these you think these companies acquiring these colors for nothing? You think they tell you to dress in blue when you go do an interview for nothing? Because blue brings about trust, loyalty. You know what I'm saying? It gives off comfort. They attack us in so many ways you don't even have no idea. 
Now that everything going digital, now they're attacking us through the, through the, uh, through the airways digitally. Why you think they want everything to be digital? I told y'all, analog is something you have to physically go touch. If you know anything about being in the studio back in the day, it was analog equipment. Now everything is digital. The same shit you could buy analog that you could touch is in the computer now. It's digital. So they can, they, a bitch can be in New York and call you well in Miami and fuck your day up. Just by seeing whatever they seeing on the phone. Think about that. They can reach you from Miami. From New York, I mean. All the way in Miami and fuck your deal. That energy travel from there to there like that. Because it's digital. <laughs> you feel what I'm saying? We used, to, we used to communicate like telekinesis. We used to communicate. You know how you be in the car, you be singing a song in your head. And the bit beside you will finish it. That's how we used to communicate. But we lost that. Fucking with this European way of living. We lost that. You know what I'm saying? We don't know how to access our pineal gland. We don't know shit about a kundalini. That type of energy. Yeah, yeah. For those who know, know. Yeah. We lost all that, bro. So what I'm telling you is this. These are small hacks that you could do. Same as I have spoke on when I did. And thanks to everybody that did share that video when I spoke about anxiety. I used to have anxiety. I didn't know what the fuck it was. But once I learned what it was, you mean tell me I'm in control of that. It's, it's a panic attack I'm fueling and giving it the life that it has Just off my thoughts Once I figure that out, oh no, it's fake Anytime I ever try to have another anxiety attack I'm like, come on motherfucker, you fake I mentally defeated that I didn't need no medication <laughs> I ain't go to no I ain't had to be Baker Act and all this shit Baker, uh, Whatever it is, Baker Act or whatever None of that Everything is mental, bro You can heal yourself but you've been taught not to access that. That's a whole nother video. But anyway, these are small hacks that you can do on your daily life, bro, that make your life better. Instead, if you got a two, three hour drive, guess what? Man, fuck this, listen to all this fucked up ass rap music. Throw your podcast in and learn. Make this something that you do all the time so you constantly. One thing about it, when you, like like Dr. Phil on um, Valentine said, when you, when you stop living is when you stop learning. Well, as you learn and you steady moving forward And the more you know, the further you go Or if you're in the car, your wife or your significant other Your little boot thing If you driving, read this book while I'm driving Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, this shit finna hit different Read this book, baby, while, you, while we driving Or she don't wanna read, throw on the audio Man, I don't waste my time doing nothing that I'm telling you, I'm very jealous of my time, bro I had to learn that if I'm sliding an hour or two away, I got to put on me something. I got to learn from it. I can't be listening to no motherfucking rap music. I ain't lying. No. No. I can't do it. I have to learn something. I have to put something on so I can. I have to learn something. You see what I'm saying? But that's just me. I, 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 I incorporated these small hacks into my everyday life and it changed me as a person. I don't get mad at nothing. You know why? Because when you out of control, that means you ain't in control. Whoo! Damn. I know that hit hard. When you out of control, that means you're not in control. Okay? Don't never tell yourself, I got a bad temper. You allowing yourself to be an asshole, bro. You giving yourself permission to act out. Are you crazy? And what you put out there comes back. Okay? If you implement these small hacks in your everyday life, you'll be, you'll become a better person. You will attract better people. You will be in better places because you vibrating on that on that frequency. You did what I'm saying? Real talk. So, like I say, you don't have to acquire a million dollars or a car or all this to be happy, bro. Happiness is free. Happiness keep the stress away. 80% of sickness or more comes from stress. Any any real doctor, physician, anybody will tell you that. Research it. Stress. Why do you think they want you stressed? How do you get stressed? What stresses you? What colors bring about stress? Like I told you, the colors in the jailhouse, on the wall, the paint, the color, it brings stress. You don't know that. They do. Psychology. I told you, everything they do, they have a psychology. They, have, they Everything is, what's the psychology in this shit? 
because they want to learn. Psychologists is how the how the mind work, how the brain work. So when you see a bitch writing, like I told you, when you see a bitch in jail, and them folk be writing, mm -hmm, asking questions, they studying you, man. Okay, they want to know how you act under this condition. When you add this, take away that, boom, 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 boom. Okay, I told y'all they did projects with rats where they put all male rats together, and before long they went to humping each other. They knew putting all males in jail together, eventually they'll start humping each other. Not all, but you get what the fuck I'm saying. They know these things, man. These people not smart, bro. They just get ahead of your thinking. I keep telling y'all this, man. Jeff Bezos ain't no fucking... What, what? Oh, he's a... Oh, he's a... No! He just has the data. That's it. He just has the data. They know what you buy, when you buy, when it sells, when it don't sell, when to put it on sale, when... In them 12 months in a year. Once they calculate this, okay, these cups, these forks, this blanket, these tires, they know everything that sells. What part of the year it sells? How long does it sell? What part of the country at most does it sell? They know. <laughs> you, they, come on, bro. Us as people need to catch up. Well, at first, we need to get from up under their construct of the way they see that we should live. We are living through somebody else's ideologies. Of course they should be winning. Why the fuck wouldn't they? They built this whole construct, the matrix and all this shit. They built it. Not you. So when you see or you uh you say what is a what is a man? Depends on who told you what a man was in the first place. Because if they say a man is this, but always showing us some other shit on TV, see, that's the trick. Oh, you supposed to be doing this. Yeah, but why the fuck y'all glorify this knowing we are creatures of habit? You, you, you follow me? Oh, a woman is this. If, well, why you keep showing women on TV, they, they, you know, they fussing, fighting, pulling the hair, throwing water, cussing each other out and... And then we are blamed when we don't follow suit with what they say a woman is. We are creatures of habit. You understand that, right? We we, we cohabitants. You know, you could drop us anywhere in the world, we will figure out a way to adapt. They know this. Meaning, if they don't feed us the bullshit every day, we will figure it out and be like, something ain't right. Even though we do, but we just constantly being distracted, being entertained. You feel me? You feel me? That's another video. Anyway, I ain't want to make this that long, but go with those hacks. Trust me, man. Your life will change, and once you see it, you see it. Once you get them, you got them. It's your responsibility, man. Nobody else's, man. In order for you to be mad, you got to allow yourself to say, "I'm mad." Why would you say that? I'm never mad. I don't even know what mad mean. I don't. Oh, you sick. Bitch cough one time. <clears throat> <clears throat> oh, take him to the hospital. For what? I don't even know what sick mean. My body don't my body my body don't um attract to that emotion, to that word. I don't even know what that word means. And a lot of y'all gonna be like, this nigga hood crazy. No the fuck I hate. Same thing I say about Kanye West. I don't agree with everything he do. No, I don't. But I'm smart enough to know a nigga that's worth what he's worth, been where he's been, did what he's did, you can learn something from him, bro. You gotta open yourself up. Like they say, you can learn a lot from a dummy. You gotta open yourself up. I'm always open, bro. I don't like a lot of the shit that he do. I don't. But I'm smart enough to know this nigga ain't, he not dumb. <laughs> you know? I can learn something from him. That's all I'm saying. And once you start opening yourself up, bro, it'll, bro, the universe will reveal itself. So with that being said, man, it's, it's all love. But incorporate those hacks. Clean your space up, man. Clean your car up. Clean your house up, man. Just go clean up. Watch how good you feel afterwards. Go clean that back porch off, man. So when you get back there, you can sit down and clean your environment out. Like my mama said, if you walk in a house that's dirty, you'll dump ashes on the floor. If you walk in a house that's clean, you're going to take your shoes off. This is the same way we act to our neighborhoods. We need to clean that shit up. Pick up the paper. We need, we need to 
uh, paint the houses. We out, we be our own HOA, shit, for the hood. Put in money. Let's put in money and buy garbage cans. Garbage cans on every corner. And that might cut into business because like I say, father is your, business is your father, religion is your mother because of this fucked up ass world these people done created around us. So we put garbage cans everywhere. Now we putting garbage in the, they, you know, they, you know, they get paid to dump garbage, right? You see how they get us? You got to pay for, you even got to pay to die. You got to pay for everything. Man, you know, that's another video. Man, you know I love y'all, man. It's your boy, Pop, boy Papa Duck, man. I'm going to let y'all later, man. Hopefully y'all have a blessed rest of y'all year going into next year. And don't be waiting till no next year to my, my New Year's resolution. Man, nigga, right now. We changing right now. Right now. Change right now. You feel me? So with that being said, man, like I tell y'all, man, in order for y'all to be found, you must first be lost. I'll get with y'all on the next video. Yo, yo, hold on, hold on.